Hi, we are the Maritime Sisters and we are on a mission to propel innovations that contribute to a sustainable maritime future. Today, on this perfectly sunny day, we are at Sodarduk, talking to CEO and co-founder Koen Burgers. He's on a mission to electrify the world with clean and floating solar energy. Let that sink in while we ask him all about this potential game changer for our industry. So, Koen, thank you for inviting us. Can you explain to us where are we and what are we looking at? Yeah, well, thanks for, uh, for being here. You're looking at the uh, first solar duck uh, floating solar energy farm. Uh, wow. Already here for uh, one and a half years. Not yet located offshore. That will happen in Q1 next year. This one is in the River the Waal, the biggest river in the Netherlands. So uh, already floating? Oh, absolutely floating. Uh, but this one has been producing a clean uh, solar energy for, uh, for uh, almost uh, one and a half years now. Super cool and very relevant. You already mentioned it's clean energy, but how does it contribute to um, a sustainable maritime future? Yeah, well, the, the maritime uh, industry already uh, showcased uh, that sustainability is, is good business as yeah. well. Eh? Uh, so uh, offshore wind, of course, uh, is, 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 is very well known for the past uh, two or three mm -hmm. decades. Um, uh, but as the majority of the world's population lives in, in wind scarce, uh, but sun rich regions, this could be sort of a next gen, uh, you could say, uh, in in, uh, in maritime energy yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and, solutions. And is it also, it, it, so it, you say it can be complementary, it will be complementary to offshore wind actually? Absolutely. Or? So uh, the, the production profiles of, uh, of offshore solar, of solar and wind are highly complementary. Mm -hmm. So combining this with uh, wind is a very good idea. Perfect. Uh, but also standalone, uh, this can be a, a very relevant uh, solution. Yeah. I think of islands in the Caribbean or, or Southeast Asia that are running on diesel. Maybe we can do our next vlog over there. <laughs> You're invited. So, floating solar is the future, you say? Can you explain to us what are your next steps and who can potentially help you? Yeah, the next steps uh, is uh, Q1 next year. Uh, then this, uh, then well, this not this one, but we will build a fully offshore uh, mm -hmm. located uh, energy plant, half a megawatt located uh, most likely off the coast of Ostend in Belgium. Yeah, very cool. Um, and that will take us, uh, well, basically uh, take us offshore uh, and build, be, yeah, that will be a very important proof point in the technology. Um, yeah, and what is required, uh, uh, infrastructure like this mm -hmm. always is a little bit finance heavy and, and may, uh, securing that finance in the Netherlands is, is kind of difficult. Yeah. So if yeah. you are out there and realizing finances or want to invest in clean energy then? Absolutely. Yeah, looking for a sustainable investment, contact Koen. Absolutely. And uh, next we are always on the lookout for, uh, for uh, offshore installers, uh, cable manufacturers. So, tel uh, so talent basically. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, good. Do you have any advice for others that also want to innovate in our industry? Yeah, I would say just start. Uh, okay. I, uh, I was. I had a very comfortable job uh, at a very nice employer, by the way, called Dame Shipyards. Oh. Uh, but uh, yeah, well known to you. Yeah. <laughs> but taking the risk and uh, uh, making the step uh, and, and, and and realize this uh, these kind of things is is a real is not only a cool journey, but it also learns uh, learns you a lot. Yeah. Uh, and I think this is uh, this is a great addition to what we already are doing in the Netherlands uh, in the maritime industry. Yeah. Wow. And it's got to feel good to contribute to the sustainable maritime future. Absolutely. So take the leap and make it happen. I think that's, that's a wrap. That's my advice. Yeah. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks. Thank you.